Hi everyone, Mikey79 here and welcome to my round 4 of Akeem's tournament. This time I'm playing against Hail to the King. He's playing an Esper control deck with lots of counters. So this isn't going to be easy. On top of that it's 8 o'clock in the morning here so I'm not at my freshest. No excuses though but uh, gonna be difficult. Now if I do win uh, I think I'm uh, safe for top 8 because I have 3 wins in. Same for Hail to the King, if he wins, he got 3 wins, so... Now, the biggest concern is uh, Gideon, I guess. I am going to keep this. It's a slow hand, but he plays slow too, so... He does play Ulamok and all that... Uh, all that nice stuff. <laughs> so I do have a very slow hand, so we'll see what it does. But having four mana in this deck already in my opening hand against a slow deck, it isn't that bad. So, Like I said, my biggest concern is a uh, turn for Gideon. Plays a mirror. Oh, Nisa, it's not for now. So I do have two planeswalkers in my hand. Now the best thing would be to play them at my 8th turn, but that's late. Now he's going very aggro here. I'm not used to that. Okay, I can play this already. Which is pretty good. He does have suppression bond. And um, the exalting an angelic edict. Now, I think he plays 7 counters, it's just something I gotta get through. Now I'm pretty sure he has a counter up. He's going to dig for another counter, or even more, or a uh, planeswalker. He plays all three, he plays uh, Chase, Gideon and Op. So I'm not gonna play Op. Now I'm going to keep the Mortuary Mire for a potential Nisa. Play this. So next turn is an up turn after a Nisa. And maybe the turn after that another Nisa if he counters her. Okay, this is gonna be interesting.
Okay, so there it goes up. Okay, so I think I made a mistake there. Sorry, I'm not saying much, guys. I try to focus. Another place, Walker. Jesus. Does have a counter? Yeah. Yeah, I'm flooded right now, so that's not good. It's too bad. Guess this game won't be it. <laughs> the time that I got mana was maybe I uh, no I don't know thinking if I made a mistake perhaps I think making the token with Nisa was the right choice for a beating now, so... 
Yeah, second evil leap isn't doing much for me. In the act here. Yeah. It's a little bit early for a... Uh, for an Ulamog, I guess. <laughs> He's gonna dig. Now he does have a pretty strong deck in my honest opinion. I think actually it's one of the better. Uh, I was surprised that he already uh, that he lost one game, but other than that, he's been playing very well. He's om he got a solution for almost everything. So yeah, I think it's a pretty strong, strong deck. Now I probably went searching for another. Um, counter. Also plays for uh, wipes, the planner outburst that we've seen in the language. Yeah, this isn't doing it for me. If he doesn't play a creature, then I got nothing. And by the time I get a creature now, uh, he can counter it, so... So I guess it was a bad hand and him tapping out in the beginning gave me some opportunities, but... Yeah... Gideon, like I said, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a pain. I think that's... Uh, his biggest twin factor actually against me. And he's got a lot of card draw, card advantage, so he just goes search for it and Yeah. Well. Flooded beyond imagination. <laughs> well. well, he could have won by now. Well. Did he hit me last turn? I can't even remember, I don't think so. Down to two. Gonna need a little miracle. <laughs> yeah. No, another land. Yeah, I really flooded here. Yeah, nothing much I can do about it. It is what it is. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, nine, eleven, fourteen. 14 lands, wow. And then I got a few evolving wilds, no, yeah, two. So 16. Yeah. yeah, that was a... Uh, too bad, too bad. I had the planeswalkers and that was it. I uh, didn't have anything else to go with, so... So let's play the second game. Well, we're not giving up, that's for sure. I do think I have a chance, it's a little one. But I do think it is there uh, online against other people. I can win from Esper decks with this deck. 
uh, it happens. But I do have the element of surprise there. Here I don't. Also, um, yeah, that Gideon man, it's a real pain. <laughs> Can't get over it. Also, Planeswalkers in general are the weak spot for my deck. I don't have a straight solution for it. And he he needs them very hard, so he's searching for them. So, yeah. They are a good wing condition in duels all around, so there aren't many solutions to it. Okay, let's see if we can put up a fight this time. Um, not with this hand, I guess. Don't have the green. I think that's a tricky one. You know what, I'm gonna keep this. I know it's a lot of land, but at least I got the mirror and I got an up. So, maybe it's the wrong decision, but I just hope he doesn't go to aggro like uh, last time. I hope I, I hope I draw some things now. I, I prefer, I, I've been screwed too much lately. So seeing a hand with quite some land, it's ac actually pretty attractive to me. for acid moss that's for sure so <laughs> yeah thinking I shouldn't keep this hand one two three four five six seven mana So is Gideon coming by? He is. Jesus. Always Gideon, man. What the hell? No, I can't play up, so he's tapped out, so I guess that's something. And another land. Yay. He's probably gonna plan our outburst again, maybe. Well, if he does that, he can beat him to death this time. So. Okay. But
Oh, he probably has another one, so. But I got no choice, I gotta try it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. And you know, I'm flooded again, so. Yep. That's another GG, I guess. <laughs> uh. Well, the thing that I was afraid of, it's happening, so yeah, Gideon two games in a row, Jesus, man. I mean, it's not his fault, of course, he plays it, but he, he's, he's lucky to have it uh, on turn four every time. Yeah, I doubt she lives, but I gotta try. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yeah, those counters, it's something <coughs> you gotta get through, and the more mana he's got, the more difficult it's becoming. I know, he, I mean, he can he can save up his cards because he's beating me to death with his Gideon, so he doesn't have to play anything else. It's just a win condition on its own, and everything I play will counter it, so, yeah. Because even that, he doesn't have to play it. Now he can even counter everything else. So. But that's not bad. Yeah, there's a Celestial Flare, of course. Yeah, this deck is too good for me. I can't beat it. It's too hard. Like I said, he's got a solution for almost everything. Well, I guess there's no shame in losing to that. <laughs> what the hell am I going to do? And another land. Yep, this is game. all she wrote folks so i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh next time i will have to win because i played with two wins and two losses now so i really have to win the final game to make it to top eight so there's no choice anymore so i hope i can do that um congrats to hail to the king uh i see you getting pretty far in the tournament um you got a great tech and i wish you best of luck in the future man great job Okay guys, see you next time. Bye bye.